Hey guys, this is the Andrew Sapien. So today we are going to have a look at a new custom ROM for our Mi Pad 1. This is Remix 2.0. Remix OS mainly provides a full PC experience with floating app windows, taskbar and a start like button. I've already made a video for the Remix 1.0. The link is in the description. Remix OS 2.0 is actually better. It's based on Lollipop. So today we are going to review the ROM and check how we can install it on our Mi Pad. So, let's get started. So as mentioned earlier, the ROM is based on Lollipop. It is pretty smooth just with some bugs like the bluetooth is broken however its pc like experience is very appealing the rom looks very good and smooth we can do multitasking we have a taskbar at the bottom and the toggles on the right hand side and a start button we can say that it's a start button on the left hand side so let me just show you some multitasking So we can resize the apps we are working on, only some of the apps are supported, like here I am working on the MX player alongside I am using the UC browser. So we can resize the activities, it is good, it is actually on a tablet it looks good because we have a big screen so we can do multitasking easily. No other ROM provides such feature actually, in the Nougat we have split screen but it is also not that good. It doesn't reproduce the PC experience that we like in multitasking. So Remix OS is a pretty good alternative. The ROM is smooth. The ROM came some time back but I was waiting for all the bugs to be fixed so that I can share it to you. So as we can notice that Jide has tried to reproduce the Windows 10 experience. The notifications are flashed on the top right hand corner. We have a start button and a flat taskbar. The apps we are working on are shown at the bottom on the taskbar and on the right hand corner at the bottom we have some toggles of the clock and memory usage, voice, brightness etc. The installation procedure is pretty simple as it is with other custom rooms for the Mi Pad. 
you have to flash the team win recovery project. You must be on the stock blobs. By stock vendor blobs, I mean that sometimes for shield based rooms, we use shield based blobs. So you have to be on stock MePad vendor blob to install this room. The links to all the required files are in the description. Please make a full backup of your data before proceeding further because you have to wipe the system and data partition and caches of course to install this room. So after backing up you have to wipe system data and caches from the team win recovery project. After that install the remix OS zip file. There's no requirement to flash the G apps because already the room is equipped with the play store. You can also flash an additional zip file for root and one more file I have provided in the description for the Dolby Atmos which is a great soundboard you must try that. And do check out other custom room videos for the me pad on my channel and yes there is also an Oreo room out there. So do check out those videos too and have a good day. Happy flashing.